And this is where the crash happened. Now, when I was speaking to the mother, she was telling me that she actually feels really guilty for what happened in the crash, even though it wasn't her fault. Halloween morning, Mirka Ribeiro was on her way to work with her one-year-old daughter in the back seat of her car when something unexpected happened. She was T-boned by a dark pickup truck in southeast Fresno. She was crying. I was like, you know, it was very traumatizing. Um, once I crawled out to get her out, um, when I turned back to look where he was going, he, he was driving off. In California, more than 19,000 people are injured annually because of hit and run crashes, according to Demas Law Group. That's about 52 people getting injured in a hit and run collision per day. I wish my daughter wasn't there in that situation. I wish she didn't have to go through that. You know, as an adult, I mean, especially as a, as a mother, we would protect our kids. We would put them in bubble wrap if we can, you know, but, um, you know, it was just something um, just out of nowhere, out of the blue. It wasn't really, and I have no time to prepare, um, but just thank God that she's okay and we're both safe. Mirka tells me flashbacks from the crash have been playing in her head nonstop. Every time I close my eyes, I just hear her screaming and it's very traumatizing. I'm just scared to even, you know, get behind the wheel just, just for my safety, my daughter's safety, and it's just very traumatizing. Mirka and her one-year-old ended up visiting the hospital for their injuries. She says she hasn't driven since because she's afraid. It makes me feel guilty even though it wasn't, you know, my fault. It just, it, it just makes me feel horrible knowing that she was um, put through that and um, there was nothing I could really, you know, do about it. Since police have not yet caught the person who's caused the crash, Mirka is now asking anyone who may know anything to please speak up. They can just come forward so um, we can we can get this investigation going. Um, it, I would be really upset if this um, ended here and we never found the person responsible. Now in the video, you see Mirka's blue car cross the intersection over here when a darker truck does hit her car and T-bone her. Now, Mirka and her daughter has since been released from the hospital with minor injuries, but again, Mirka is still asking the community if they do recognize the truck or have any information about the truck to please speak up and call into the police department. Well, we're glad to hear both of them are okay tonight. Thank you, Sophia. And uh, like Sophia said, if you have any information about this incident or the person driving that pickup, you can contact the Fresno Police Department at 559-621-7000.